Another year, another my career. What's good, internet? My name is Attack Slug. Welcome to WWE 2K19. My career, the road to Slugomania. Let's begin, shall we? There I am. No hat. Where's the hat? Hey, big BCW show this Friday night at the high school. Tell your friends. Don't need a flyer. I go to every show. Wait, is that you? Uh, what do you mean? Facing Mr. CQ in the main event. It's definitely you. No. Uh, <laughs> I guess I can see the resemblance, but that guy's a huge indie star. Why would he be out here flyering for a show? Hey, is this weirdo bothering you? Yes. He's one of the wrestlers. <laughs> no, no, I'm not. Have fun at the show. Yo, I thought wrestlers had money. Why would he be driving around some crappy bug van? See? See? Good point. More proof that I am not who you think I am. Sure. You gotta check out this guy's highlights online. He's going to be a huge star in WWE someday. <laughs> Thanks. That's nice of you to say. I mean, about the wrestler on the poster who is, um, definitely not me. Come on. Let's go. Definitely not okay, me. Beat Mr. CQ, I can't stand that guy. Well, maybe I'll see you in the crowd Friday night. I mean, he's a fan. As a fan. Uh, definitely not from the ring. Because I'm not a wrestler. Nope. Definitely not. Also, that face is not quite right. It's not quite right. I'll get there eventually, but, you know, we had to get this thing done, so we're here today doing this thing. A few days later. Bugs be gone. Man, those early PS3 textures in here. It's a little rough. I've seen better looking vans in PS3 games. But here we are. You know what? After previous years of my career, I'll take what I can get. An actual story? Sure, I'm on board. Where is my gear? Oh, I'm sleeping in the van. Okay, yeah, sure. Great. Fancy. Doing very well for myself. That's about what you get making money on YouTube, too. That's about what you're... Just about where I'm at. So, you know. There we are. There we are with the hat. Very important to hide the fact that the face is not quite right with the face scan. And the texture is well weird in my face. It's a whole thing. But, here I am at BCW. Well, well, is it a kitchen? We're in the kitchen. Baron Blade got chubby. Oh, good, it's Albert. Sweet tea. Tons of funk. Uh, my career hub, when you're no longer in a match, cycle through people you can talk to, interact with, and hit X to interact with them. Uh, hit triangle to browse messages, and upgrade your my player. Top left, new voicemail. Uh huh. Alright, triangle pet messages. So we got Matt Bloom, Baron Blade. And that's it. And that dude with the choker on just kind of, I can't select him. So that's interesting. Uh, options here. All right, my career settings. Tutorials, baby. Tutorials. So the tree, abilities, things I'm not going to do here in the video form, but they're here. I can do them. So, all right, let's uh, ask, see what's going on here with Baron Blade and Matt Bloom. Baron. Hey, I want you to meet Matt Bloom from NXT. Matt, this is my protege, Van Gogh. I'm a big fan, Mr. Bloom. I mean, I've studied all your matches from your run in WWE and Japan. Really great stuff. You're really hairy. You must be a true student of the game. I try to be. So why do they call you Van Gogh? Are you some kind of artist? Not quite. I gave him that name because everywhere he goes, his dad's old work Van Goghs. He practically lives in that thing. Practically. Yeah. <laughs> practically. <laughs> so what brings you out to our show? I'm here to scout your opponent. Cole Quinn. Doesn't Regal do the scouting? Isn't that his job? Yeah, Cole's great. He's a true coal miner. Cole's great. You won't be disappointed. I'll have my eye on you as well. Sure yeah, you really? will. You're rustling coal, so it'll be kind of hard not to. <laughs> yeah, yeah, good point. Well, I should go get ready. It was nice meeting you, Mr. Bloom, and thanks for coming out to the show. Yeah, okay, sure. Also, how come Baron Blade doesn't talk like a caveman? That was canon in 2K18. That was how he talked. He was, he was terrible. Uh, alright, so now I just hit X to go have a match here? I guess? Or no, I guess I'm doing this thing with this Man, weirdo. I, 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 slow your roll, Greeny. Tonight's my big chance to get signed to NXT, so don't do anything to screw it up. <laughs> okay, look. I'm gonna give it everything I have tonight. And we'll see where we stand after that. All I know is I'll be standing in Orlando at the Performance Center. You can continue standing in high school gyms. 
We'll see. So is the end of this going to be us two at Mania? At the very end of this, my career, it's going to be me versus Cole at Mania or some nonsense like that. Uh, alright. So I can talk to Cole again? Like, why would you do that? But I guess I have the option, so let's do that. I'm going to see if I can see the same cutscene. Right, here we go. Tonight, instead of trying to get Matt Bloom's autograph, suck up. Alright, we get additional bits of business there, and now it's just, I can do it again. Will he say a different thing, or the same thing? How about you worry about same facing thing. Okay. me tonight? Just make it sure, just make it sure. It's a video game, I have to check. Anyway, let us go to our match here in the main event of BCW. Let's get out of the kitchen here, seriously. And so I welcome you to a fine Saturday here on the program. If you are new to the channel, every day, 5 p.m., I'm here doing videos, wrestling games, talking wrestling. Also, down in the description, new shirts for sale. Check, check them out. Anyway, obviously it is Saturday. And Super Showdown was this morning, if you're on the East Coast like me. Started at 5 in the morning and ran until about 9-ish. So, thankfully not a full 5 hours, but still a bit of a long show uh, for an early morning international deal. And like I said, it was pretty much a house show. Like, much like Crown Jewel is going to be in a couple of weeks here. Pretty much a house show. So, that being said, John Cena was there with his JBL hair, and that was weird, but he had his sixth move of doom type deal, the backhand, back fist thing. But then, I guess, back to China with Jackie Chan and whatever he's doing. Sure, that's fine. Um, otherwise, not much changed. Out, you know, in, in these matches, not much changed the landscape, really. I mean, we do have a new cruiserweight champion in Buddy Murphy, and that's cool. And shockingly enough, having somebody win in their hometown is usually not what they do. And the Iconics won, and it's usually, the curse is, if you're in your hometown, you're gonna lose. That's typically how WWE and Vince likes to run things. Don't get a big head, you know, that kind of thing, right? So, that was, uh, interesting. But, uh, the craziest thing, I think, was the fact that Daniel Bryan beat The Miz in, like, two and a half minutes. Like, the entrance for The Undertaker was longer than that entire match by, like, twice. It was twice as long. Uh, which is, it ended in a roll-up. Now, I do like that the roll-up was kind of a throwback to a gimmick that Bryan had in Ring of Honor. That Mr. Small Package. That was pretty cool. But, otherwise, you're like, alright, it's gonna be this big epic fight, and then, no... Brian just wins with a roll-up, and now he's going to fight AJ Styles at Crown Jewel, another house show. So don't expect anything to change with that whole bit of business. Enough with Mr. Suspenders here. Let's uh, get down to brass tacks and get into having matches in front of these, you know, 50 fans. Something like that. Here we go. Must win by pinfall or submission. Now, I did do a bit of work on, obviously the character model, and I did do, a, you know, a bit of stuff with the abilities, but I had not touched the moves that much at all. So definitely in my best interest here to get the moves set to moves that I want. Now, concerning the loot boxes, right, you can totally buy the moves you want. You can, you can totally buy the individual moves you want, but the amount of VC they cost is astronomical as compared to buying a bunch of loot boxes with VC, or buying tokens to get loot boxes with VC, right? So, I spent a lot of my VC getting the hat, getting the right beard, and that kind of thing. I don't have enough right now to actually get the capture suplex as my signature, or the salt shaker type maneuver as my finisher. So I'll get there, give me a couple of days to earn enough v VC, and I will get there. Believe you me. So that's kind of, at this point, all I really care about is, alright, I'll do a bunch of loot box stuff for other moves, There's but so give me the right signature and the right finisher, so and I'm kind of fine with that. So, also taunts control. are important, and I kind of have just some very generic taunts, and that kind of thing, so it is what it is, but we're going to take care of uh, Mr. Queen here. Uh, I do have the top rope diver ability, and I do have to an elbow, I'm not pretty sure it's this. Oh, yep, elbow drop. So, I, again, I did see the 5-star Frog Splash, and it cost a lot of VC to buy it. So, again, very key core parts of this Attack Slug Wrestling character that I need to get in the game I don't have yet. So, I'll get there. I will certainly 
get there. But, uh, so far, it's been okay. Like, I've been playing a bit on and off while getting videos done here and there. It's, it's, it's been okay. Uh, uh-oh, here we go. Alternates of, like, I, I totally did that, and I forgot, I, I, I forgot that I did that, and now he's gonna get out of this button mashy type submission. All right, there. I'm surprised that the indie ref is not wearing your standard Foot Locker t-shirt, uh, and such. So... OCS732, you're blocking the school nurse's car and she'd like to go home now. That's a pretty good detail, having that stuff be done uh, over the intercom. I can dig it. I can dig it. Alright, here we go. So, what is my current signature and finisher? I don't know. We're gonna find out. Not enough stamina? Alright, it's not. It is a running. It is a super quick. Super, uh, it is a running super kick, which I, I didn't do right there. I don't. I don't know. You know what? Here we go. Boom. D, D, T, and then drag the man toward the center. Pin the man. Will that be enough for Mr. Cole Quinn? Two. Now was he booked to win, or did I call an audible there and just decide to squash him? Like, what's the deal there? Typically, that wouldn't be the case. Of, all right. Ooh, Albert's here. Let me, uh, you know, just, just let, let me totally BCW screwjob you and win the match. Like, I don't know. It is what it is. Yep, I did it. Like, isn't he the champion and I'm the challenger? Was there a belt on the line? I'm, I don't know. Anyhow, look at them fans. They are hype for the attack slug. They are seeing a legend in the making. Good match, Van Gogh. Yeah. Great Thanks. job out there. It means a lot coming from Orlando, you. Orlando, here I come. I'm gonna get a condo on the beach. There's no beach in Orlando. Well, then I'll make sure to furnish my condo with wall-to-wall -wall sand. Before you start making big plans, we have a few things to discuss. Like what? My start date? Future opponents? Waist measurements for the NXT title? Not exactly. To be honest, I'm not a fan of your Mr. CQ character. You need to come up with something different. It's not really a character, but fine. I can come up with something different after I get to NXT. Full disclosure, I don't think you'll be heading to NXT. Not anytime soon, at least. You're just not ready. I was actually more impressed with your opponent over here. Wait, what? So I've decided to offer him an opportunity instead. You'll have a tryout match on an up-and-coming WWE event. Really? Yes, I've been doing this a while now, and I know talent when I see This is some I kind of it. joke. Because you were supposed to be here to scout me, and not him. Plans change all the time in this business. That's a good lesson for you to learn. I have to go catch my flight. You and Baron will be hearing from us soon with the details on your tryout match. Don't make me regret my decision. I won't. Thank you. This business. Maybe it's your dumb bow tie. Hmm? Hmm? I told you not to ruin this for me, and look what happened. Whoa, all I did was give it everything I had out there, okay? I can't help it that he saw more potential in me. Yeah. Potential? Or was it your boy Baron here putting you over with him? No, no, we're, we're not friends. We're not friends. Favorite, but I didn't think it would cost me a shot at WWE. This was all Matt Bloom's decision. Do you think I want to see my top guys leave? <laughs> and do you think we want to stay here forever, wrestling in front of a few hundred people for crap money? That's not what I meant. No I'm just money. Saying we're building something good here. Besides, if you left, who would design our title belts? I only make your belts because you pay us so little for wrestling. It's so bad, teacher's pet over here has to live in his van. I thought that was a joke. I only live in it when times are tough, which is most of the time. Well, that nickname's not as much fun anymore. Look, you just need to trust the process. We're building a brand. And think of it this way. If any of us make it to WWE, it'll be good for everyone. It'll help put BCW on the map and lead to more opportunities. Oh, yeah. Easy for you to say. You're the one with a WWE tryout match. He's right, though. What's the saying? A rising boat will lift all tides? Uh, yeah, I that's think it's the other way around. The thing. Whatever. Come on, let's drop this thing and bring it in for a BCW handshake. Yeah, no thanks. I'll let you two celebrate. No, we're not friends. Did you watch my did you watch my videos from last year? Don't worry about him. And congrats! I'm truly happy for you. 
No, I don't like this at all. The following week. This isn't NXT. This, this is Raw. is way bigger than the high school gym. And the VFW. And the state fair. Why are there announcers already here? Combined. Don't let that bother you. All that matters is the rings the same size. I mean, th right, not technically. Good they're... point, but I assume their rings aren't covered in rust and mysterious stains. Hey, we're working on fixing that. Come on, let's go meet Triple H and uh, try to play it cool. You don't want to recite his entire career history like you did with Matt Bloom. <laughs> <sighs> it wasn't his entire career history. We didn't mention hey, Tensai. Hunter! A sore spot. This is my guy that Matt Bloom wanted to bring in for the tryout match tonight. At Raw? Nice to meet you. You trained him, Baron? I did. Then he's, he's terrible. One of my top students. Because Baron's terrible. I'll try not to hold that against him. Yeah, he knows. Look, I've heard a lot of good things, but I want to see you in action tonight before we decide anything. Do you have an opponent for him yet? I do. Surviving in WWE is all about how you handle adversity. So you're going to face the toughest guy we have. Actually, the toughest monster we have. Braun, Braun, Braun. Go introduce yourself to Braun. Don't worry. He won't hurt you. Not until your match, at least. You got me in here doing an Ellsworth? All right. Look, any man with two hands has a fighting chance. I'm not worried. I'm not worried. It's just Braun. It's fine. Uh, hey, Braun? I, I just wanted to introduce myself. No autographs. I'm, I'm not a fan. I'm actually your opponent tonight. You mean victim? So how do you want to die tonight? Uh, I'd like to survive tonight, if that's okay with you. What I meant was, in what type of match do you want to get these hands? Oh, good. Okay, um, I get an option here. I will always go tables match, certainly. Uh, tables match could be cool. The owner of our promotion could never afford tables, so we never really got to use them. I can't believe you thought I was actually going to let you oh. choose the tables match tonight. We're going to do what I want to do, because I'm the monster among men. So it'll be a steel cage match. That way you can't run from me. Steel cage. Great idea. That was my second choice. My face looks terrible. Video games. XP, my player. New. Oh, that's a bunch of VC. Okay, cool. Perhaps I should get one of my moves for tomorrow. And then the loot pack store. Here are some tokens because loot packs, because loot boxes. Y'all know the drill. Y'all know the drill. Anyway, that was day one. Also, if you're getting a tryout, it's going to be down in Orlando at the Performance Center, not at the Monday Night Raw Arena. That seems weird. You have an NXT arena in the game, so why not use that for the tryout? Alexa Bliss, we'll get into that tomorrow. I'm a tax slug. Thanks for watching. More videos every day. See you then, right here on this channel. And I'm out.